Hey guys, Spencer Kaufman here with the Internet Hustler YouTube channel. Today we are talking about staking crypto. Welcome to the Internet Hustler YouTube channel. My name is Spencer Kaufman. Today we are talking about staking cryptocurrency. Now, what is it? Staking crypto is uh, really, it's a, a way for you to make high returns by locking up your assets. Staking crypto can be thought of similarly to savings bonds or certificates of deposits from banks. Essentially, you are taking your cryptocurrency and you are locking it up in an exchange. So you're lending your money to them. It's not really a loan though, because we're going to talk about lending in another video where you can lend your money to other people through crypto and make huge returns. So staking or locking up your assets is you're, you're agreeing you're not going to spend it. You're not going to cash it out. So it's, that's why I say it's like a savings bond or like a certificate of deposit. If you have questions on savings bonds, check out this video we made on savings bond investing. You can look at that one. Also, uh, like I said, certificates of deposits was traditionally a way for you. You'd bring your money to the bank. Savings bond is to the federal government, CD is to the bank or an institution, and then they would give you an interest rate over a period of time, much less than a savings bond. Savings bonds could be decade or years, uh, CDs could be months or a few years. CD, you could check out a video here to learn more about certificates of deposit. Now, staking or uh, locking up your cryptocurrency is more like a CD because you lock it up for a period of time, usually like one month or 90 days. Sometimes you can leave it locked up for long periods of time, like a year, but you just renew the contract every so many days, every 30 days or every 90 days. So it's, a, it's more like a CD, but the returns are immaculate. So if you're not on Nexo, you need to be. Check out a video here that's all about Nexo. Use the referral link, get your bonus, and get on Nexo because they will pay you excellent returns. You just lock up your asset. It's called fixed terms, and they're one month. You can automatically renew them, and even if you don't want to lock it up, you can just put them in the Nexo wallet, and they'll pay you like 8% or 10% on your money. Then if you want to fix it or lock it up, stake it, they'll pay you a bonus percent on your money. So that's huge. Otherwise, KuCoin is my other favorite platform. Check out a video here. KuCoin, they have fixed rates or locking up your assets, staking, whatever you choose to call it. They have rates and returns like 50%, 100%. My average rate of return on KuCoin assets that I lock up is about 60%. Now, if I had tons of money, I'd put it in there and just keep doing it and, and get really rich. But sometimes the crypto that you're in goes down by the time your term is up. So you need to be aware that there is risk. You could, you could lock up like on KuCoin, it's not main coins. They're all altcoins and high risk assets. So you might grab a, a crypto that's worth a penny and buy a hundred bucks worth and then lock up uh, whatever that is, 10,000 coins or 1,000 coins, and then it'd be 10,000. But either way, you lock up this, this amount at 60%, and then 30 days from now, that coin could be worth 0 0.001. So now it's a hundredth of a penny, and you just put your $100 is now worth a dollar or $10 or whatever, depending on the rate that the coin moves. So with Nexo, they are let's say the blue chip or the, the more secure cryptos, things like Bitcoin, Ether, Litecoin, uh, Axie Infinity, you know, they've got all these, they also have stable coins that are guaranteed to be worth a dollar. So that is a perfectly safe investment to lock up your assets in stable coins that pay you anywhere from 10 to 12%. So definitely start with Nexo when it comes to locking up or staking your crypto because the risk there is less then as you start to learn more, dive into KuCoin because you can get way more returns, but the risk is also higher. Sometimes the, the crypto could, could fluctuate big time and then the 60% that you earned for that one month of the period wasn't worth it because you lost more than the interest paid you. And so you need to be careful when it comes to staking. Uh, my, my 
real recommendation for you is if you want to start staking your cryptocurrency, then you need to start out with Nexo. Get on Nexo and transfer your assets in there. Just let them be because they're still liquid. They're not locked up. You can pull it out at any time. You can sell it at any time. You can transfer it out at any time. And so this is very rare. Most exchanges, whether it's on Kraken or whether it's on um, Polynix or Bitrex, any of these other places that uh, Coinbase even has you lock up assets, a lot of them, they make you hold that locked up. It's locked for like one month or 90 days or one year, whatever the term is, it's locked. You can't get it out. So if the price quadruples, it's locked. By the time that it's, it's unlocked, the price might be down. Well, what if you wanted to sell it when it quadrupled? Because you probably would. Nexo does not make you lock them, yet they still pay you a high interest rate. So start out there, transfer your assets there, get them in there, they'll pay you interest. Then if you want, you can lock them for 30 days and then let that go and get a bonus percent, a bonus interest rate. So it's very, very uh, worthwhile to do that on Nexo. If you need the link, it's in the description below. I'll put it down there for you. If you have any questions about staking or locking up your assets, your cryptocurrency, please comment below. I want to help you. I really do. This isn't just talk. I want to help you out. So comment below. Also, I hope you like the video and subscribe to the channel. Comment below saying that you liked and subscribed. And as soon as you're done watching this video, start learning more about staking your assets on Nexo because that's really truly the best place that I've found. They're still liquid. You get a great interest rate. They're pretty safe. In addition, Nexo is insured, which is unheard of for crypto. So your assets are protected. And that's what really also a big deal. So when you think of staking or locking up cryptocurrency, think of a certificate of deposit. You're lending money or giving your money to an institution, like in a certificate of deposit, you're giving it to a bank or an institution and they're paying you an interest rate. With locking up your assets, you're giving it to an institution, an exchange, and they're paying you an interest rate. So it's pretty much like a certificate of deposit. Again, any questions, feel free to comment below. Until next time.